So for the time being, we're just gonna have to sit and wait uh, for the fog to dissipate. We're just waiting for the weather to clear and hopefully we'll get some jets. to another video on my, uh, my YouTube channel, Nigel's Chief Vlogs. My name is Nigel, and today is supposed to be uh, my CBU Life Adventures episode number five, but we have a problem. That is foggy. Um, today is uh, Saturday, and just over there, by about six, seven kilometers as the crow flies, is Buffalo, and there's an air show taking place. And uh, I was hoping to get out on the water, just over here, and watch the air show. But as you can tell, the fog rolled in. So for the time being, we're just going to have to sit and wait uh, for the fog to dissipate. Then we'll try and get out there and watch the air show. We're going to drive down to uh, Fort Erie to the river. It's about 15 minutes away from here and we'll launch from there and uh, hopefully we'll get to see the air show. So uh, let's go. Right, this is where we're launching from. Yeah, yeah. So uh, Fort Erie River's right here. Um, another jet skier. He's called uh, Darren from uh, Ontario, CDU Forum. Told me to come here safer to launch due to the weather and he's right the sun's out he must be out there on the blue jet ski so we're gonna launch here and uh hope to catch the air show it's uh still very foggy towards Fort Erie but this sounds quite nice all right we're back on the water here at Fort Erie for another adventure we're gonna hopefully try and get the air show going uh brought the wife with me today so I'll see if she can hang on long enough so we'll head out to the water down to the bridge uh, see what we can see. Let's go. It's gonna happen, it's gonna happen right around here. Uh, that is Fort Erie, the old fort. There's several hundred people, maybe a couple of thousand even, just lined all the way along the waterfront there. Uh, the actual air show takes place in Buffalo, which is just over here on their waterfront. So we're on the Canadian side. We're just waiting for the weather to clear and hopefully we'll get some jets. Looks like the ceiling of the cloud is starting to lift, but it's still a little too low. So we'll just, hopefully something will happen shortly. This is insane! It's coming right for us! Oh! Look at this! Jesus, Nigel! 
It's not my fault the thing's turning around. <laughs> okay, we seem to be turning around a little bit. He's insane. <laughs> oh my God. Looks like we're gonna get an encore of this uh, Loadmaster. I think it's a tanker. Oh my God, here it comes. It's, it's coming right at us. This is epic. Oh, firing the jets up. quite uh, quickly here like we were level up there so we've drifted about three or four hundred meters in like 10 minutes so we're gonna motor up there again and drift again Jeez. Might get some noise now. A jet just appeared on the scene. Can't really see him yet. He's just approaching the buildings over there. Huh? Yeah. That's he's going this way. shitty out here so we'll come out again tomorrow and do some more filming and also the weather's nicer so in the meantime we're gonna head back in into uh down the river <laughs> nice 
morning down here at Crystal Beach. Water is calm for now. But Rick's with me this afternoon. Uh, yesterday we had Danny, the wife. I got Rick, who's a fellow storm spotter like myself. So watch the air show and keep it on the skies at the same time. And uh, yeah, we're going to make our way down to Buffalo. As you can see from the uh, the Garmin, we are slap bang right on the US Canadian border here in the water. So we just use the GPS. That way we don't get any trouble from the Coast Guard to come over. Um, most of the boats I've seen going past us are New York registered. Um, but gee, because how busy it is, like, we're gonna get run over in a minute. <laughs> it is scary. This is far busier than yesterday. Far, far busier. So I just hope these boats see us that we're actually here. Look at this guy. This is a little boy there, yeah, I'm watching him. So I've got my wits about me today. Holy shit, we're getting swamped. Hold on. That's all right, okay. Whoa. They don't care about us. <laughs> few people have uh, left a couple of uh, buoys in the water, anchored and left them there, so we're attaching ourselves to one of them. Stop ourselves from drifting down there while we wait for some more stuff going on. There's currently an acrobatic display going on. Uh, we're too far away to see that, but we just saw a couple of fighter jets probably over Crystal Beach, Ridgeway area, probably flying over towards Port Coburn, just waiting, so I presume there's a formation coming out shortly. He's gonna be sick. Oh, no way! <laughs> Check this out. Looks like the, uh, we're gonna guess it's probably gonna be the Blue Angels, but can't confirm it because we can't see that far, but just over there, just starting now. They just looped in from over the Canadian side. Look like they banked over Crystal Beach way. And now they're coming over and make their way down that way.
It's hard to see these uh, Blue Angels because they're staying pretty close to the uh, shoreline down there. They haven't really come over our way yet. That looks like Andrew coming towards us. You can tell by the way he's riding. <laughs> oh, what an entrance! What an entrance! <laughs> He's just running down all the way from Port Coburn to see the end of the air show. <laughs> oh, yeah, it was a good ride. I thought he was coming right at us. Like for a little split second, I nearly pooped my pants. Uh, then he pulled out. And I was like, whew, it was close. But that was brilliant. Sea Doo Life rocks. All right, air show's over and done with. Wasn't bad after all. Yeah, the weather's good. Now we're gonna head back to Crystal Beach and have a coffee. Thanks for the boat traffic's going that way. We get to go this way, into the sun. Someone's gonna... <laughs> I don't know if my camera's picking it up, but literally hundreds and hundreds of boats are just exited from the uh, Buffalo Harbor here, and they're all heading back down the Niagara River. It is wild. <laughs> right, homeward bound. <laughs> That's another adventure I've been done with. Hope you enjoyed it. See you on the next one.